Hello everyone, we will start with our new topic in module pool. Our new topic is add exit command. Before I will go into detail of this topic, firstly, we will replicate the scenario and then I will come on to this topic. I will go to the program. Suppose I'm going for the first program, which we created. I'm running the program. Suppose I'm not giving any input and I'm clicking on to submit button. So user should get the error message that please fill the required fields. How to achieve that part first? I'll simply go to layout. I will double click on this input output field, which we created. Now you, I will go to program and we'll simply choose required. Required means input is compulsory to pass. I will close the screen painter and I will activate the program. I'm running the program. Now, if I'm not giving the input and clicking on to submit button, you can see I'm getting a error message, fill out required entry fields. Now what we will do? I will create one another button here. Suppose name of the button is back. We'll start. I will go to the screen hundred. I will go to layout and I will create a one more button here. Suppose back. I will give some name to the button. Suppose back underscore BTN. I will give some text to the button and I'll double click and give the function code to the button, which is compulsory. I will simply save this layout, close and activate our program. I'm running the program. Now, back button is here. Suppose you are not giving any input and you are clicking on submit button. See, error is coming. That is correct. That is 100% correct. But if you are not giving any input and you are clicking on back button, if you see when I click on back button, also the same error is coming. This thing is wrong. Just think if you are filling some online form and you have not filled some mandatory thing, if you are submitting error is coming, that is correct. But if you are clicking on back button or cancel button, then why it should ask for or why it should check for mandatory things that is wrong. So on submit button, it should check for error. That is correct. But on back button, it should not check for any error. It means on the back button, it should go to the it should go whatever the requirement we have. Suppose on the back button, we will take this program to our main application. In the previous video, we just integrated all the application into main application. Suppose if user will click on to the back button from the individual application, it will take back to the main application. This is our requirement, suppose. But as of now, what is happening? 
the same to same error is coming on back button also. So, what is the solution for this particular thing? And this is our topic. Our topic is add exit command. What is the purpose of add exit command? Add exit command is used to leave the current screen. Means you can leave the current screen without the automatic check take place. Means without the checking, it will uh, it will allow you to leave the current screen, and that is our requirement. Means whenever user will click on to the back button it will not check anything and simply leave this screen and will go back whatever we want in this case we want the program should go back to our main screen itself this is the our topic and this is the explanation of add exit command now we will start with how we can use add exit command. First step, you should take the function type of the button as E. I will go to the layout. I will go to the layout. I will click on to back button. Now, first, first important step, take the function type of the button as E. E means exit. It means you want to exit. I will simply close and activate the program. First step, what we did, we took the function type of the button as E. Rest part we will continue in the next video. Thank you.